So Buster Olney just came on and said in uh, about 10 days, look for baseball to send their umpires to a game with, uh, along with their remarkably difficult task of calling balls and strikes. And we saw sometimes umpires can totally blow it last night on Sunday Night Baseball. And in addition to all of that, they will be tasked with policing the game to make sure pitchers aren't putting stuff on the baseballs and that there are players currently in the game that are sending video excerpts to Central Baseball's office, the Central Office of Baseball, saying, we're seeing this. This is what these people are doing. And basically, like they've got their own John boys out there mm -hmm. who are breaking down film and saying this is what pitchers are doing and every pitcher now has a book on them and umpires will know this and they'll be sent out to inspect pitchers TSA style after an inning is over. <laughs> and, and seriously, so what, what does that look like? How often are umpires going to do that? Sometimes, you know, there's six, seven pitchers in a game. They're going to do it for each one. What happens if it's DeGrom versus Scherzer? Are they going to do that to DeGrom and Scherzer? Hey, Max just struck out the first, you know, seven of the first nine or whatever. He's got to be cheating. Or, or DeGrom is just, DeGrom came out, as you know, in his last start through uh, 10 straight 100 mile an hour plus fastballs and then snapped off a slider to get out of the first. You're going to stop him on the way back to the dugout and say, let me look at your glove, take off your belt. Let's do this. Well, oh. Seriously. Or do player or or do players of a certain status have like clear like the pass where you just go straight through? You don't have to take your shoes off. You don't have to take your belt off. All you got to do is just show your ID. So there's pre-check and clear, just two different. Things. I don't know. Like do 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 certain players if there's no book on them and they're Cy Young Award winners in the past, do they not get checked? I'm I'm being serious. Yeah, it sounds facetious. Like you, you got to check everybody. It can't be check arbitrary. Check and then what everybody. are you going to do? You're going to literally make them take their belt off in front of the entire stadium, or do you remove them to a different spot? Is this really going to be done as soon as they're off the first baseline or going back to their dugout in the third baseline? They're stopped right around where they meet the the fanny pack guy to take a look and put the headsets on, you know, to re replay something. Is that where they're going to do it? A Are white they gonna, tent, Rich. No, I'm serious. They're going to do a white tent. Like a blue tent? They blue put, tent. put up a blue tent yep. like like when, when when the NFL takes a look at injured players? Yeah. Come in the uh, tent. Honest, no, uh, uh, are they going to do this in front of everybody? So the baseball, uh, we'll, we'll be right back after these messages. Hey, while we were gone, they looked at this player or whatever, and they found it. He's out. Here's a new player in the game. And then we'll just go on with the next like, is that really the way it's going to go? Is it going to be between innings, or are we going to do it between batters? Like, no, he said it's at the end of an inning, is what okay. he said. At the end of an inning, the inning is over. You've got two and a half minutes, I guess, or in a commercial break, three, depending on – I don't know what their commercial breaks are in nationally televised mm -hmm. games. And you think managers are going to go – they'll be like, okay, go, yeah, go go check them. No problem. Or it's just like even, even with Mike Schilt, he went nuts when they asked his player to change a hat. Because that gets in the player's mind. Like, you're getting him out. He's, in, he's coming in. He's warmed up. He's ready to go. Now you're messing with his head, stopping his routine to make him change a hat. So now you're going to stop a player on the way to the dugout to make him take off a belt, lift up their pant leg, show off their stirrup. You know, like, literally, is that what you're going to do? You better think this really – you better get this thing down to a science – and make sure all the umpires know how to do it, that all four of them are on it. Does the crew chief do it? Is the crew chief the one who pats him down? Like, you know, <laughs> is the crew, is the first base ump the pat down guy and the second base guys and the glove check guy and the third base umpire is the belt guy and the crew chief just, you know, inspects it all? Or Rich, do they have a separate umpire? Not on the field. Who comes out and handles? Well, he's in the each pat clubhouse, down. and then yeah, dressed like the gimp, and, and he comes no, and handles I'll, I'll, the. You pat know what down. I mean? No, it, it's you can't take someone down to the clubhouse. You can't. I mean, I guess you could. That you do do it off 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 field. I'm waste but more it, time. It, you'd have to have a special umpire to do that because you've got to right. have four men yeah. on the field so to I'm adjudicate saying, things. There would have to be a special guy who handles. This is. I mean. I mean. But what else are you going to do? I don't you can't know. do I mean, it if everybody is beginning to cheat and players are, are sending in video 
and we're seeing spin rates go through the roof, and I'm watching a game where a ball's not put in play for like three minutes, but there's two men on, and there's excitement. There's two men on, but they walked there. They 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 got they got walked on. They got they got on due to a free pass of base on balls, random checks. Maybe they don't. It's just like I don't prevent it. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I'm all for getting fixing this and cleaning it up. But, but doing it in the middle of the season. The middle oh. of the game. But I don't. But look, I, I will just say this: good for them, man, because it's gotten out of hand. Players are talking about it. A manager's going on saying, giving up the yeah. Mike Schilt. Mike Schilt lifted the kimono. Mattingly saying parts of the game are unwatchable. He's not wrong. And you know he's a perfect human being, Don Mattingly. <laughs> <laughs> Donnie Baseball. <laughs> Woo! Donnie! Donnie so, Baseball! Donnie Baseball! <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah, so kudos to the Major League Baseball. The, the house is on fire. You got you to gotta, you gotta call the fire department. The problem is, is the fire department needs to, you know, figure out how to attack this house fire. Because you can make it even worse. Wow. But at least they're doing something about it. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.